हेलो डियर्स आई होप यू ऑल आर फिट एंड फाइन एट होम नाउ आई एम महालक्ष्मी योर सोशल टीचर टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द सोशल साइंस ग्रेट थर्ड लेसन नंबर एट द नेशनल सिंबल्स इन दिस चैप्टर ब्रॉडली वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द नेशनल सिंबल्स now what is national symbols national symbols of india have been chosen to reflect its culture beliefs and heritage we must feel proud of our national symbols now coming to the first national flag you all are aware about the national flag it's called a tricolor flag indian flag so many kind of names so now the national flag of india is a horizontal tricolor deep saffron kesari at the top dark green at the bottom in equal proportion white in the middle the white band has a navy blue wheel in its center and the wheel has 24 spokes so this is our national flag first top we can see the saffron color center we can saw the white color and last downwards color is green centrally we can see a circle with the 24 spokes so this is our national flag in this national flag every color indicating some or symbolizing some meaning now let's go we can see the meaning of the colors first the saffron color stands for the strength and courage of our country and its people the white band indicates peace and truth the green band stands for the fertility growth and fruitfulness of the land so these three colors are indicating a different different meanings the charkha has been taken from the ashoka pillar the ratio of the length of the flag to its width is 3 is to 2 once again the saffron color it indicate the strength and courage of the india second the white band indicating peace and truth the green color indicating the fertility growth and fruitfulness see how beautiful the flag is hosted so topmost color is saffron center white and bottom is green center navy blue color is a circle with the 24 spokes and then we have some rules for hosting the national flag daily we can't flag host the national flag in some special occasion or in schools we can host the national flag the flag should not be allowed to touch the ground in any cause the flag should not be in the ground floor it always kept in a some higher places it no it must it must give some value the flag should not be displayed with the saffron band down sometimes is uh, by mistake we should not turn the flag saffron color down and green color is topmost so in a proper way we have to hoist the flag and no other flag should be displayed higher than the national flag and we cannot host the any other 
any other political party's flag or other religious flag we should not hoist the flag higher than the national flag we can hoist the flags but not higher than because we have to give a higher position for the national flag it is a duty and when we are hoisting the flag it should be after sunrise we have to hoist the flag and before sunset we have to remove the flag next coming to the janagana mana always you will sang the song in their schools and any Uh, national functions so it is our national anthem national anthem all are aware about the national anthem janagana mana is the national anthem of the india it was composed by the noble rabindranath tagore it was officially adopted by the constituent assembly on 24 january 1950 its recital takes 52 seconds proper respect should be shown by standing up when it is sung whenever you will hear that national anthem as a indian citizen you must supposed to stand for a minute it is a duty and in the way to give the respect of our respect to our country approximately the janagana mana sung in the time exactly in 52 seconds not more than that now you can see the four headed lion guess the pictures what is this yeah it is the national emblem of our country the emblem of india is an adaptation of the lion capital of ashoka at the sarnath adopted on january 26 1950 the national emblem appears on all indian currency you can find this emblem on your currencies and some coins also a wheel appears in reflect relief in the center of the abacus with the bull on the right and a horse on the left below the abacus in devanagari script satyameva jayate the meaning of the satyameva jayate is chut always win the battle so once again four headed lion downwards a circle chakra and right side a bull and the left on a horse and a devanagari script is written on the downwards that is satyameva jayate truth always win the battle how it is the royal bengal tiger so this is our national animal bengal royal tiger national animal the royal bengal tiger is the national animal of india it indicates the strength agility and majesty and nowadays in 1973 most of the people because of the hunting we can we lost so many of tigers so a government of india introduced the introduced the new project that is called the project tiger to protect the tiger from the hunting so in now they are in a comfortable and safe position in india
now how beautiful it is looking this is the national flower of india national flower the lotus is the national flower of india special position in the art and mythology of ancient india it has always been a symbol of indian a species of indian culture lotus have lots of medicinal properties and its look very attractive so lotus is the national flower of india next coming to the national bird now you can see the beautiful feathers of the peacock how the peacock is showing the feathers peacock is the national bird of the india wow so it's looking so beauty national bird peacock is the national bird of india it represents the unity and unity of bright and intense colors and has reference in indian culture now you can see a boy is swinging in a banyan tree yeah banyan tree is the national tree of india the branches of the india ban indian banyan tree hang down and take root in the ground over a large area so it gives a shelter for a, so many birds and the peoples because of this character and its long life banyan tree is chosen for the national tree now in this chapter we have discuss about the seven national things that are the national flag national flag is called as tricolor then national anthem janagana mana is the national anthem it's sung by the rabindranath tagore composed by the rabindranath tagore and the national emblem we can get the national emblem from the asoka at saranath then national animal royal bengal tiger is known as the national animal of the india the national bird national flower its lotus the national bird is peacock national tree is banyan so whenever you can see the national flag you should when the flag is hoisting you must to salute and you you have to give the respect for the national flag and when you can hear the national anthem you must supposed to stand for a minute so in this way you can give your respect and you can do your duty so finally you have to respect for the national symbols and always you have to proud to be a indian jai hind thank you happy learning